Hey guys, this is MacHeads101, and today I'm going to be showing you a little cool thing that I noticed that you may not have known about that's uh, pretty nifty. So, as you probably already know, if you use iChat with something like AIM, you can just drag an image into the chat, hit enter, and it sends right in the chat and they can see it on the other end. And they can even send you an image back if they do the same thing on their end. Um, but what you might not have known is, let's see, he sent me this image and I sent him this image. When you close the chat, most people would think, okay, the images are gone now because I've closed the chat. Well, the actual fact of the matter is that iChat stores the images on your computer for an indefinite amount of time. Uh, I don't know exactly why it does this, but you can actually get these images back even once you've closed the window or even across like reboots, you can still sometimes get the images back. So I've made an app for this. It's called iChat Images. Let me just go ahead and throw it up. So you can see here's the file I sent him. Here's the file I sent, he sent me. They're sorted by date and everything like that. Um, and since these files are actually located somewhere on your computer, I can just double click one and it shows up right here in Finder so I can do whatever I want to it, whatever. Um, now let's say you don't want this on your computer anymore. You go up to File and you just hit Delete and it deletes itself. So that's pretty cool, I think. Uh, pretty nifty. Um, another feature is, let's say I send him another image and I send it to him. The second I send it, it'll get cached right here. So uh, all I have to do is go up to File, Reload, and now here it is again. It showed right back up. So these are actually sorted by date, and that is very useful when there are tons of images here. Uh, before I made this video, I deleted all the images that I had, uh, that iChat had cached. Um, but I had maybe 50 images, and it was pretty easy to navigate because, you know, you can just go up and down and... Um, you know, it's sorted by date, so it's easy to find the one you want. So this is just a cool little thing that I found, um, and I made an app for. So you can download this app. There will be a link in the description, and I think I'm going to post the code to GitHub. So uh, look out for that. So thanks for watching MacHeads101. Subscribe, and goodbye.